Good evening, everyone, and welcome to uh, Leon's press conference with uh, Rudy Garcia and Anthony Lopez. Before you ask questions, please uh, advise us who you are speaking on behalf of. Yep, go for it. No, I don't have uh, more adrenaline because I have enough already. I think um, playing a semi-final in the Champions League um, is a big chance and we're happy about that against a very tough team in Bayern Munich. But, you know, we've arrived here at this stage, so we will try to do everything we can to uh, pose uh, Bayern a lot of problems and to get to the next level. Question du Gogi, mais de l'équipe. Bonsoir. Do you, after a match that you've just played, do you uh, not change a team that wins? Just before I answer that question, uh, I'd just like to say something before I forget. I'd like to say uh, to the 500 people that have sent me messages, uh, thank you. Thanks for the support. We've also seen what's been happening in Lyon. The uh, joy of the people in Lyon after qualifying for these semi-finals. We've seen the banners and we'd just like to thank them for their support in the name of the staff. And Anthony, if you'd like to say something as well. Yeah, from the players, we are extremely proud and really happy to have seen all of these uh, banners, these photos, videos all over uh, the, the city. It's uh, really touched us and they, are, they have a great, um, an important place in our hearts and we were thinking about them and it's going to give us... Um, um, a lot of energy for uh, tomorrow's game. Yes, um, I think we can actually change a team that, that's winning, but I don't think it's not that important. It doesn't matter who starts the game. It's just important that we, uh, you know, we have a play a good match. There are five, you know, that will start the game and fight. Uh, five that will come back from the previous game, and they all need to perform well. Uh, even the players who played in the last match, they'll give us a certain plus and that will allow us to play well and I hope that you know, that will help them play better in the game, especially Moussa for example who didn't play the last match but came on, uh, he scored two goals and helped us to qualify like two or three others in the quarter final who came on on the bench. The new rule with the uh, five players, five substitutes, will help us, especially if the players who uh, come on and you know can play well and give us all they can give. Bayern is a, a complete team. If we looked at uh, the stats from the Manchester City before the game, then I think you know it would have been difficult. And I think it's the exact same with Bayern. They have great stats, but we can't just be focus on that. I know that we're the underdogs. We need to face the match in the same way we did for, against Juventus and Manchester City. We, we are the underdogs and we realise that. But there is a chance we have to go through. A small chance. And so we need to take advantage of that chance like we have done in the two previous rounds. Thank you. 
de ce type pour faire redescendre le feu et, et, et basculer. Est-ce que ça veut dire que le danger, c'est de rester sur les sports city et, et de ne pas assez penser à la suite bah, c'est surtout que oui, c'est bien d'être en demi-finale. Yeah, it's great to be in the semi-finals. C'est déjà une performance assez énorme. It's an enormous performance that we've uh, done so far. Avec Leipzig qui se retrouve dans le dernier carré. Leipzig as well, who have uh, come to the last stage. But we, you know, we haven't won anything yet. So that's why we need to uh, keep our determination and stay active and focused on the next match. The two uh, consecutive qualifications against the champions of uh, Italy in the second place in England, um, you know, was exactly what we needed, and it showed that we are capable of great things when we have the mind and the spirit that we've showed in Turin or against the city, Manchester City. That was, you know, great to see. A real pleasure to see my players. Uh, give everything for, for one another. It's really incredible what they've done, but I hope that they are able to do even better and we stay in uh, Lisbon. <coughs> Juninho is still uh, quite young. He has a, a lot of energy. I try to be a little bit uh, more calm and I because I have a little bit more experience. Juninho has won everything with Lyon. He was part of the great team that um, um, played really well in France during a decade. So that's what he transmits to the players. He's right. Uh, you know, you you play like you would train like you play. Play like you train. Sorry. He's a a great player and a, will be a great coach. So we need to listen to what he says to the players. He's done it. Uh, himself and he still um, you know, trains with a great intensity with the rest of the team and so they had the results that they had because of that so it's a, a path that we need to follow on professionalism and uh, the intelligence of uh, a group team would you like to say something about Juninho uh, Anthony? Yeah, I, I, I followed him as a supporter <coughs> and when we when we see him we all uh, we're all impressed because of his past the, the player he was what he did for Lyon and to see him like that at the moment uh, in a semi-final of Champions League you know he says to us he's never been to that stage before you, you deserve it and when Juninho says it to you it you know makes you really happy une question de Jean-François Gomez du progrès No, no concerns. I'll try to do the best I can. It will be the group, though, before anything else, whether I'm called upon or not. It won't be that I'll have less work to do. I'll still have a lot of work to do, uh, which is which is good. So I need to be uh, there for the team, and I'll try to do uh, my best, the best that I can. Um, 
Il y a aussi des supporters qui m'aiment bien à Lyon. Well, there are fans who do who do like me at Lyon. They're not all against me. Non, mais je, je, je me suis déjà exprimé à ce sujet. I've also uh, spoken I spoke about this subject before. Bien évidemment, tout, tout homme dans la vie. Obviously, everyone in life likes to be liked, but um, when it's not the case, you need to move forward. You need to just be yourself, uh, like I am with my staff and and my players. If, if I'm there, then it's, you know, because of the work that we've done uh, as a group. I think it's, yeah, it's the work that we've done that's brought us here. As it was said uh, before City, uh, the more you eat, the more appetite you have, so to speak. So we're, we're really happy to have got this far. And, you know, we have the final that could, uh, that is there. We need to make the play a really great match. If we want to overcome the Germans, we'll need to put forward our qualities uh, in tomorrow's game. <coughs> In the training, we saw um, tests being done. Do we know if they were negative? The match is close. Oui. Only four days away. Oui, tout le monde est bien Does this pose any problems? Everybody is fit. I'm not sure about the results yet um, because we left training quite quickly and we haven't seen them. But it's important to have uh, everybody available. We spoke up with the uh, staff to see if, uh, because we're playing four days after, whether this could be a problem or not. If it was three days, I think you know it would be more of a problem. Four days, I think we're okay. But you know we need to change. We can change half team if we need, and other players will come in and, and do a job. So you know we will do anything to, to win this match. City has scored more than 100 game goals in their, in, in their league. So if we're talking about uh, mathematics, I think, you know, the other 18 German teams will vouch for that being the same in Germany for Bayern. I can't, we can't really focus on the stats because if we do, we, we'll just stay in the hotel and won't play the match. We know, of course, who we're playing against. We know their strengths. They don't have many weaknesses. But like uh, all teams in the world, no one is perfect. To have been able to to show what we can this thus far uh, is great, and we we're capable of uh, keeping possession, pushing forward, and we're capable of doing anything. Whether that's defensively or offensively, we just need to be confident in ourselves, in our teammates, and I think we've shown that so far. I know that we're capable of posing problems. We've seen uh, how Manchester City uh, played, and that shows that, um, yes, we are underdogs. We're not expected to win, but um, we have knocked out big teams. The teams are now um, asking questions about Lyon because of what we've showed so far. We're not um, such a big mountain to climb as a team, but uh, you know, all you need sometimes is a stone in your shoe, and it and it will become harder to climb, so to speak. And uh, you know, we hope we are that stone for for Bayern Munich. Question for Anthony. Have you seen uh, Corentin Tolisso recently? Yeah, I have. In fact, I just uh, came across him earlier. It was uh, great to see see him and great for him as well. We spoke a little bit. He hopes to, to play against us because obviously playing against uh, the team who... who um, we played for previously, you know, is, is important for him, but 
if he uh, if he does play, you know, we can't. Um, it will be it will be tough. Une dernière question éventuellement. Bon, visiblement, c'est terminé. Well, Merci I think that's the end. Thank you for everybody. Merci Thank you to everybody. Everyone. Thank you. See you tomorrow.